What's up, everybody? Welcome to Podcast Now. I'm Alex. In this video, I want to go over my Pirates of the Caribbean wish list for 2020. I kind of want to write a list to Santa, even, in a way. Um, I want to discuss what I want to see and, and what I want to receive from Pirates of the Caribbean in 2020. I, I, firstly, before I even jump into that, I want to wish you guys all a very Merry Christmas and early Christmas. I know this, day, uh, this video is going out a little bit before, I believe five days before Christmas. I'm recording it quite a bit early. We're going to have a video on Christmas day also wishing you guys a merry christmas before you guys for the pirates community out there those very very loyal people that have stuck with us for almost three years at this point it'll be three years in february you guys absolutely rock i really hope you guys really enjoy the holidays have an awesome awesome day have an awesome week have an awesome new year's all those kind of things we're going to be picking up videos we're going to be making videos obviously into 2020 we'll have pirates videos for you guys there as well and i'm expecting for it to pick up i really truly am when i when i'm thinking of Pirates of the Caribbean, when I've thought of it in the past and over these past couple months, even after D23, you know, after D23, I really, for myself specifically, I really kind of considered it to be over. I was like, all right, well, like we're going to get something. It's just probably going to take an excruciatingly long time. And, you know, again, like with, even with these videos, like we just can't do them every other week. Tyler and I can't just keep doing them over and over again because we're going to run out of things to talk about. But really after D23, well, firstly, I've kind of liked settling in and doing these videos kind of sporadically and doing them whenever I could. I think they kind of provide better content because I really can zero in on a specific topic. But also, too, we've had a little bit to talk about since D23 of, of definitely a push for Pirates of the Caribbean to start up again. Um, and maybe not without Jack Sparrow, maybe not a Pirate. At six. In fact, most likely neither of those two things, but at least we get kind of a, a little bit of a positive sign, a little bit of hope that Pirates of the Caribbean is going to continue and actually come sooner than at least I, and I think a lot of people probably expected it to. Um, it should have come a lot sooner. Really, when you look at it, you see a, a, a movie like Wonder Woman, Wonder Woman uh, 1984. We just got the trailer a few weeks ago. Uh, that movie is coming out in June, right? So it's coming out three years after the original came out and that's when pirates came out was almost three years ago and so when you when we've talked about when we would have liked to see a pirates of the caribbean sequel or a new pirates of the caribbean something and we said like they really got to try and shoot for three to four years don't go don't go like more don't go five six years before another pirates thing because you're really going to lose even more of people that are interested in it and that's kind of what they're doing but my wish list for 2020 is to see something, is to, and, and when I say that, I don't mean see a trailer. I don't mean see shots of them filming because I, I really doubt either of those two things are going to happen um, in 2020. I feel like filming could happen late 2020. I feel like that is totally a possibility, but I feel like 2020 is when we're going to get a lot of rumors, when we're going to get a lot of leaks, when we're going to get a lot of talk of, okay, Jerry Bruckheimer is officially back. He will be uh, producing it. Or, okay, we have like a rough idea of the cast of what they want to do. Here's who we're looking at for like the leads. Um, we know like the Batman movie. That's a good one to try and compare it to. The Batman movie is coming out July of 2021, so a little while away. But we've already gotten pretty much the cast. We know the cast. We haven't, in terms of my, I mean, what I know, and maybe I just haven't searched hard enough, I haven't seen any set pictures, although they are filming, so they are filming it right now, um, but I haven't seen anything about it, so maybe they're keeping a very, very tight lid on it, but we know the cast, and we really knew the cast dating back to, like, what, September-ish, so... We kind of knew stuff two years before the movie even came out. And if you hope or you expect Pirates, the next Pirates, to come out in 2021, even 2022, 2020 is probably that year where, and it is, I mean, that's just how movies work, where we get some information. And it's easier for higher production, higher scale movies, because you kind of, like, it just kind of finds its way out there into the world, right, where they tell us stuff. Because, you know, filming will probably take anywhere between five to seven, maybe five to eight months to complete. We know editing probably takes around nine to 12 months to complete. So, like, there's your two years, pretty much. So, like, if they start, even if they start filming, like, middle of 2020, let's say, I wouldn't really expect the film to be ready until 2022 because you have to give them maybe six months to actually film it. So, maybe the beginning to kind of the first couple months of 2021, and then you give them around a year to edit it and so maybe it comes out again like around Memorial Day of 2022 honestly that is very well what could happen that would be five years after the last Pirates of the Caribbean it makes a lot of sense in order to do that if you're going to start filming in 2020 which we talked about that in the last video 
you got to start doing stuff. And, and I know that obviously uh, directors and writers have been linked to it, but we need like Disney confirmation. Like, yep, Pirates is happening. We're moving forward with a new Pirates. And that's what that's my wish list. That's what I want at the bare minimum from 2020 is Disney to come out and say, Pirates of the Caribbean is still alive. We're doing a new one. Here's the general idea. Like, like here's what we're thinking of. And maybe not even that. Maybe not even a synopsis. But here's who's directing it. Here's who's writing it. Jerry Bruckheimer will be back. Uh, and maybe that could be like early 2020. They don't have to give us the cast. That could also be just rumors and leaks. Like, oh, they're looking at this person. They're looking at this person for the lead role. Oh, they're looking to maybe bring a few people, maybe like side characters back. Oh, they're looking to, you know, things like that. They're looking to add this villain. And here's a good villain idea those are kind of the things i expect to see in terms like the first half of 2020 as we get on though i would like disney needs to start making things official here's the cast filming is going to start happening in fact they're going to film right now or they're filming next week or they're filming next month i feel like that could happen if we're expecting a pirates movie by like 2022 which is too long but we've made it this and like that's the thing right is let's rewind the clock right back all the way in 2017 when pirates 5 came out when we were riding high when we finally finally got it when we were talking about it every single week when the movie came out we were talking about it every single day Tyler and I were so happy that it was out and we were all as a community so happy and we had said like we want to keep this going we hope that you know eventually like if it can come out in three years like we're gonna get stuff immediately after and it's like wow like if we would have said 2022 back in 2017 we would have just all gone crazy of how long it was to wait to be honest right now at the time we're at right now it's not even that bad right because we're almost there we're almost we're basically we're only what 10 days away from 2020 in general and then we're into it and you got to imagine 2020 there's going to be a lot of things that happen 2021 there'll be even more and then 2022 or even 2021 will be when we get the movie so we are close we are getting there we have been suffering we are in the midst of our suffering phase for not having pirates when we really should have but there is a light at the end of the tunnel. It is happening. It's just how fast can they do it? We've talked a lot about it. They could have done a Disney Plus show. They really should have. They really should have had that be this middle ground so we didn't have to wait between movies. How great would it have been for Pirates 5, have a Pirates TV show maybe in 2020, and then bam, 2021, 2022, we get a brand new movie. Like That would have been a much smoother path because we could have only been like four or five months away from a TV show releasing, right? And that would have been so much fun to talk about. That really could have smoothed things over. Alas, they didn't do that, but I really do think 2020 is a big year for Pirates. So again, my wish list is that we just start to hear things faster. We start to hear more things. We start to hear things more officially. I mean, I'm all up for rumors. Rumors make great videos, right? Leaks make great videos. And I'm all up for talking about them. I love seeing them. I want this stuff to happen. I want to see leaks like, hey, they're eyeing Karen Gillan for the, the lead role. Fine. I want to hear that. At the same time, I also want official things from Disney. And official things from Disney are kind of the more important thing and, and are more in line with, oh, okay, things are definitely starting to pick up if they're getting more serious, if they're saying more things, if they're making more things official, that means we're getting ever so close, right? So that really is my goal for 2020 is for something like that to happen. I really do feel like it is. I feel like definitely in the beginning of the year, the first half of the year, maybe we're in for a slow first half. Maybe we're in for a, a slow year in general. Um, maybe it's just going to be some rumors and some leaks at first, but I do think things will pick up shortly after then. So I'm very excited for 2020. I didn't think 2020 would be like the year of Pirates of the Caribbean or the year that kind of things started to take a turn back in a positive direction. But to be quite honest with you guys, I see it as that. I really do see 2020 as the year that things start to turn around. And it's great because honestly, I really didn't think we were going to get anything for a little longer. I really thought maybe 2021 would be the first year. I'm really thinking 2020 now. So guys, let me know in the comments below. What's your wish list? What do you want to see from Pirates of the Caribbean in 2020? Casting, you know, uh, filming. What do you want to see in general of this movie moving forward? Let me know in the comments below. Again, make sure you guys subscribe to our YouTube channel podcast now hit that bell icon so you guys know when these videos go up because again they're not bi-weekly they kind of come up whenever we can fit them in and whenever I have a good idea uh, so definitely make sure you have that bell icon rung so you guys can see when these videos release 
Merry Christmas. Happy New Year. We will be coming back. Not necessarily sure when. I assume probably first two weeks of January we'll have a new Pirates of the Caribbean video for you. And then we'll go from there. As things start to pick up, they will kind of become a little less frequent as they had been the, these past several months. Um, but there will always be Pirates of the Caribbean videos on this channel. Um, and as rumors, as leaks, as things like that do start to come out, we will be covering every single one of them. Okay, so thank you all so much for watching. I hope to see you all on the next video. Hey guys, firstly, thank you so much for getting to this far this at the end of the video I really do appreciate it I do want to quickly remind you guys we are doing a community event on December 21st it is the Saturday it's from 11 a.m. to 1 p.m. Pacific Standard Time we're gonna be playing Super Smash Bros Ultimate if you guys want to play with us we have the video up on the channel make sure you guys go watch that video and leave in the comments that you want to play with us it's also a live stream event so you guys just want to kind of swing by watch us play the game have some fun right before Christmas it's gonna be an absolute blast and I hope to see you guys there.